I'm so sad because I don't want to wash my makeup off and take my hair off. I don't want to be hungry. <laughs> So it's Sunday morning. I just woke up. I just woke up, washed my face, brushed my teeth, put my hair in a ponytail. But it is the morning time. It is gloomy outside. It is cold. It's literally 50 degrees in June. You really hate to see it. But before we even jump into today's vlog for the week, I just want to show you guys what I picked up from Nasty Gal. Thank you so much to Nasty Gal for partnering with us for this video this week. So let's just get right into it. Let's see what I got this week. And yeah, let's just, let's just go. Because I don't even remember what's in the package. But I kind of got a feeling it's going to be all good stuff. Because you just know the vibes. You know the vibes when it's me. You know the vibes. Okay, so first thing is like this double zip dress it's a midi dress um, i'm going to show you guys a full body in the mirror on the side of the screen so don't worry but the quality is really really nice it's not like too thin and see-through um but it's comfortable like you can still wear when it's warmer outside so you can see we have the bump it has a zipper right here that fully functions it has like this little collar right here um it's very sporty what if it had thumb holes i think i'm gonna put thumb holes in this um and again it has a zipper at the bottom that i just zipped up a little bit to show a little leg if you will all right so next up i got this two-piece jogger set with the shorts again i'll show you a full body on the side right there oh my god this is so comfortable i wish it was warm outside so i could wear it like today because it's that comfortable the shorts are really nice thick and plush they are cream they say los angeles and green i have been I don't know who I am. I don't know where I went, but I have been loving green. So like this pop of green on the tan, this would be, it is something for me. Um, it's like, <laughs> How cute is this? So this is literally just like a, a bandeau top, but they it sent it to you like in a fabric. So I had to tie it, which was obviously easy. I just knotted it and tucked in one side. I'm not the best knotter, however, um, but we'll learn. This is so, so so cute but i've been loving yellow with the idea of pairing it with green so uh, i don't know what's going on guys i just i don't know who is influencing me right now but girl you're doing a good job whoever you are all right so next up is this orange dress i'm pretty sure we did this dress uh, a few hauls back from nasty gal as well in black if i'm not mistaken um you guys know i always love like these really casual cuts of styles of clothing with like this really extra piece of detail i don't know because you guys know i'm very simple or at least i used to be um but i like this having a little bit of something to elevate it outside of a simple box if that makes sense um so yeah i got this dress because you guys know i own tops like this dresses like this hoodies like this everything i love it again it's just something so just a little extra little detail so hey girl hey my hair started off so cute and sleek and now it's just getting busy from putting clothes on my head um so the next thing i mainly got for a postpartum because you guys know if you're not new here i have started shopping for my postpartum clothing so things to wear when i'm not pregnant anymore also things to wear when baby is here and i need to be comfortable and stuff because i don't have that much longer to go so yeah this was one of those things it's super super comfortable it's just a two-piece set it comes with some shorts um but i got this because it's like in that really nice soft gray marl material that i really really like and it just sits nice on the skin so it's just a pair of shorts like i said and it's this little crop hoodie that's adjustable on the sides with the strings um, so I like I just knotted them to hold them into place. But I just thought this would be super easy. Like if I'm having company at the house to come see the baby or something, or if I have to go out and run some errands or go to work. All right. So next up, I got this little toweling set because I'm manifesting one more vacation before baby. I don't know because I'm putting I'm kind of kind of close because I was supposed to go to sleep. But I've been seeing toweling sets like this everywhere, and I think they're so so cute because I think you could actually wear them outside like to lunch or something. But you could also wear them obviously to the beach to the pool so i picked it up in white because you guys know i love white i just thought this would be super cute with like um a really colorful bikini underneath a bright color um like a snake skin 
something along the lines or just plain old white you put a lot of gold jewelry on with it it'll elevate it make it more feminine more girly um because it is something that is more boyish in style in my opinion um so yeah love this as well everything else i have in the haul is white i don't know how we went from color to all white we're gonna go with it so i have a dress coming up next so let's try that on really quickly all right so second to last thing is another little mini dress it's so so cute again right up that same alley as the orange one very like athleisure sporty feminine because it's a dress girly because it's a mini dress things like that so this one is like in the same exact material in white but it has a double strap detail so this strap just goes this way you guys know i love stuff like this as well i have a bralette like this that i'm pretty sure makes a cameo every single weekly vlog i know it's just always at the top of my drawer when i do laundry so really really love this again i would definitely wear this with some sneakers like to just run errands during the daytime some dad sandals something like that you can wear it with heels um but i would prefer this for casual daytime i don't know just because it is in the white so it's like more brunch lunch attire and then again i think it just look cool with some sneakers and stuff like this all right so oh my god this little piece of hair is just getting so frizzy but you know what we'll move we move we're just gonna ignore her so the top i feel like i i would like but i can't get into it because you have to tie it and because my belly is so big um if i tie it it just blends in where it's supposed to be you know like a cutout detail um but it's really really cute and high quality it's this like o-ring detail top that i see all over so i will wear this with like some really nice mom jeans with like some holes in it or something like that um and like some gold necklaces like really dainty jewelry but it's super super cute but again it's just because my belly's so big that if i tie it it's just gonna go up into the top so i have to save this for post baby post baby is that the right way to say it i don't know but yeah so i paired it with these mint pants again you'll see them in the full video right here love 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 the pants they're more of a beach pant you can wear them outside if you want to i just would recommend wearing like a really minimal nude panty so you don't see your panties or anything like that um but really really love them they're like in a really nice linen material not a full-blown linen but i can't think of the other material blend with the linen so yeah these were the last two things that i got from nasty gal so thank you so much to nasty gal for sponsoring this video for us you guys know i love them yeah, i mean I, I love everything i feel like i got casual wear dressy wear casual dressy wear <laughs> um like a little bit of everything vacation wear so we have a nice little mix in this haul so let's just get on to the rest of sundays and let's see what i've been up to for the rest of the week even though today is actually sunday usually i film this backwards but we're actually going in order this time hard working woman you love to see it so yeah let's just get right into all right it. so i just quickly threw something on because i have to go um and i was busy filming so i just put on my louis vuitton hoops i just put my hair into a pulled back bun but i pulled a bang out and then tucked it behind my ear i don't know we're just doing something different you know ignore the pile of clothes that's from all the hauls i filmed today um i just have on my little harper chain is it gonna focus probably not because it's not the sony zv1 but this is from grace personalized um i just like this one because it's really really dainty that one is black blazer it's like a boxy blazer um i got this from nordstrom i like ran randomly found it in nordstrom one day and i have on my white bralette from urban outfitters the ones is the skims dupe that i love and it don't cost as much um i have on my blanky maternity leggings and i'm just gonna carry my little patent leather ysl bag um and then for shoes i'm gonna wear my dior sneakers uh i think because i have no sneakers and i'm not wearing heels so yeah that's my little ensemble for the day hey friends i'm back home so i was only gone for like two hours i just ordered some food i wanted something really good but it's sunday so my options are limited so i got a cheese steak and french fries but i'm about to drink some water because my water intake today is and then these right here y'all wow game changer for real um gender reveal was fun it's a girl and they got engaged oh sweet is that but 
Yeah, I'll come back on here in a little bit. I need to get my life together because I'm freezing. I'm like shivering. I have goosebumps right now. All right, all right, all right. I'm just really on the YouTube now without earrings. So one thing about me, I gotta have earrings on. That's my character's point in my life. Yeah. So yes, I have on a bra and panties, and I'm vlogging, and I don't care. So today's Monday. It's Memorial Day. So anybody that has served their country, thank you so much. Um. I'm just now like getting out the bed. I've been feeling like really lately. So I just been taking it easy. And especially since Harp isn't here, um, I've just been like really relaxing. Hey guys. All right, hey guys. So it's like 8.20, 8.30 at night. And I just finished my filming day for the day. So it's been a work day from the second that I woke up, but we're not complaining, blessings on blessings. Um, is that a piece of skin coming off my lip? Probably. Yep. Um, so yeah, I just finished filming. I feel so, so pretty. So I don't know if you guys would have noticed, but in the beginning of the vlog, my energy definitely was like super, super low. I feel like this dress is pretty. It's just not going to look good on me because it's not like double lined or anything. And I need like some suction. Um, but my energy was definitely very low when I woke up. And even when I filmed the get ready with me, it was still kind of low. Like I just didn't feel like my normal quirky self that I know I'm, I am, you know what I'm saying? Um, my rug looks crooked, but whatever. So yeah, I just finished filming the haul. Um, before I filmed the haul, I put on some songs that I just know get me in a good mood. And they definitely did just that. And I had such a great time filming the haul. I'm so excited for you guys to see it because I literally got some fire pieces. Like everything was so, so good. This was the one item that I got um, that I didn't include in the haul just because it was gonna mess up the feng shui. It was like an extra item that I got so I didn't need to include it even though it was sponsored. Um, but it's really, really pretty. Like I really like this color. It's just because it's not like double lined. I mean, while I'm pregnant, it might have looked fine because my belly would have, like, hit everything. Um, but everything else was so, so good. So I just was like, I didn't want to mess it up. I didn't want to jinx it, you know? Um, I cannot wait for you guys to see the haul, though. Fire. Like, I really outdid myself, guys. I'm not going to lie. I did that. Um, I'm so sad because I don't want to wash my makeup off and take my hair out. <laughs> I don't want to be ugly. <laughs> I don't want to look like myself. I want to look like this. <laughs> I love, I cannot wait till my hair is this long again. It's not even that long. Um, Cause I actually cut these extensions. They were way, way longer than this. But look, cause my hair is right here, girl. Oh, she's almost there. So I got like, how many more inches to go? Like this, this much and I'll be, good to go and I can wear my natural hair like this oh, should have never fucking went blonde being blonde run my life but I don't want to wash my makeup off my makeup looks so pretty <laughs> like I just don't understand why this is my life so I really don't want to wash my makeup off let me tell you how I'm gonna have my fan on all day because I was filming. Now at this point, I'm just going to talk to you guys because I look pretty right. Like, hey y'all. I had my fan off all day because I was filming and I didn't want it blowing in the background. I'd be hot as hell, yo. Like, hot as hell. So, I have to edit all three videos. The two hauls for the vlogs and then the dedicated haul I just did. And I also just signed a, like accepted a deal for another dedicated haul. And it's just like, I don't even got no hangers. I have one empty hanger. So I don't know what to do. You guys know everything that's in my closet right now is just stuff that I could wear while I'm pregnant. And it's very lackluster. It's a very lackluster experience getting dressed. But everything I know, you guys are going to be so annoyed if you don't even see this haul yet. Everything in this haul was so good. And I just want to hang it up so bad because everything is so pretty. So it's like, do I buy 50 more hangers and 
overdo it in my closet or do I go back through my closet and get rid of stuff that I don't want you know what I'm saying you know so for right now of course the pile of clothes is going to go in the chair this is why you don't put chairs and benches in your room because they become where your clothes go and you don't ever take accountability and actually put the stuff away life hack don't put chairs, couches, benches, or anything in your room or your closet. So it's like, do I go through that stuff and hang up all this new stuff that I like? Or do I just buy some more hangers, you know? I don't know. Oh, I just took a picture for Instagram. I'll show you guys the picture. Because um, I told you guys I wanted to break up the beach photos. Y'all. Is it going to focus? I can't wait to get my camera back tomorrow because this shit is ghetto. Who is she? Oh, she's so pretty. She's so pretty. Hello. Hey guys. Welcome back. It's Tuesday. Is it Tuesday? Yeah, I think it's Tuesday. Um, I haven't done anything today. I edited a video yeah i edited a video did all that fun stuff submitted it i still have like three more videos to edit but i really don't feel great today so like nothing's wrong with me but i've been having like really bad heartburn and i don't know if it's like because the way i slept for the last two days or something like my posture being messed up all right here like really hurts like this whole area um so i just been taking it like really easy i don't know what to do about it i really don't i can't like think of anything and it just feels like weird i was so happy to see that a lot of you guys agreed with me in the comments saying that you thought this the company sony is working with was trying to like get over on me just because they're backed by sony obviously and a lot of you were saying like once you feel as though like once you pay to get an electronic repaired that from there it's kind of downhill like it's always going to need repairs so you just rather buy a new one and to some people like i said i know that probably sounds like a waste of money but i almost think it's like a car you know how they say when you get in that first car accident in your car trial ever since then it's just <clears throat> downhill so i'm gonna put like my normal old rig back on it so you guys know i use i use um this thing from amazon which is basically basically it makes this so that if you were to put the tripod right here without it anytime you need to access the battery you have to take the entire tripod off it's a hassle it's annoying so if you buy this thing which i'll link down below for you guys um it works on most cameras i think or they have them for multiple cameras is this the right way though you screw it on and it's super easy and what happens is there's now nine little circles down here instead of the one so you can put your tripod in any of these um and that way when you need to like if you put the tripod all the way over here you can still open the battery compartment but yeah so that goes like that and you guys know i have this hold on let me take it off and then i have the actual zv1 tripod i didn't think this would come in handy but it actually does because like when i'm vlogging i can just press record i can just press photo i don't have to press any buttons on the actual camera which is nice hopefully they come out with this in like silver or white eventually so everything matches but it's not that serious maybe i could spray paint it no i'm not gonna spray paint it i could wrap it in like washi tape or something can i that'd be cute i put it in like a snake print or contact paper ideas um wow i didn't realize how much i missed this camera until i just got it back the mic thing on it or you guys know i stopped using that because i started using this because this was like coming in clutch for vlogging so i never had to like turn the lights on to find good lighting or try to find good lighting at all because this was really really useful um in days that i was vlogging outside 
and just took it off because it's just super easy to twist like to loosen it and throw in a bag um and this charge it lasts really really long but yeah so that's my new zone that's my new sony zv1 super super cute right love the white i think it's just because like all vlog cameras are black that you just get tired of seeing black you know like so seeing something like this is really really nice um, i did not realize how much i missed my camera until just now like i knew i missed it but i didn't realize how much it just looks so much better it's so much easier to use oh i gotta connect i gotta connect my little sticky stick to this one but this camera is just way 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 better so if you're looking for a vlog camera this is definitely the one it's just easier it's just made for vlogging the microphones are all over the camera um it's not as versatile like as the g7x because you can't like take full-blown photos on it with flash but at this point everybody has iphones you know what i'm saying so yeah i really missed it i think the skin softening is on and i think it's like on high i think i need to turn that down but yeah so so much better i just need to connect my little tripod stick to it so that the buttons work so i'm gonna do that but this one is just chef's kiss way better way freaking better it's just easier to use it looks better it's prettier and this white is so cute so yeah i'm gonna just hang out for the rest of the day <sighs> my back hurts so bad and i'm gonna drink some water because i am parched um so I will see you guys later. And let me show you guys how much easier. Remember when I was trying to show you my picture yesterday and it would not focus because that camera's ghetto. Let's try it again. Ready? Are you ready for this? Let's see. You see that? Canon could never. Let's do it again. I, kn I know y'all saw the difference. I know y'all saw the difference. There's no way you didn't. Wow, that camera. I mean, that picture is so pretty. Um, yeah, the can. It's just ghetto. It's just janky. <laughs> it's just janky. Yeah, yeah. This one just makes it so much easier. It just focuses on everything you put in front of it really quickly. It follows your eye to stay in focus. It smooths your skin. The microphone faces the front and the back. Just if you're looking for a vlog camera, just get this one. Hey guys. What's going on with your hair? So, it is 10.45 in the morning. I've been up since like 8. But I've been up since like 8 in the morning, which I was not planning on because I was like, oh, I'm going to sleep in today. Yada, yada, yada. Didn't happen. Um, so, um... Oh my god, there's a baby like just pushing the stroller like a little baby, like a one and a half, two year old. Um but it was the baby product that I was talking about about yesterday. So I got the Maxi Cosi Benla. So if you guys remember my Nordstrom vlog, um I believe I put the title that I was like stroller shopping, stroller shopping. I was playing with this um, high chair. It's brand new, um, not like brand new, but like the collection from Maxi Cosi is fairly new that they broke out into like the baby gear gear, um, aside from like strollers and car seats and stuff. Um, so they have like a, a little rocker. It's really nice. It's cute. It's plain. It comes in like normal colors. It's very modern-esque, which I like about it um i didn't get it though i think i still might get it to have on the second floor of the house but it's not like a true bouncer you know babies love bouncers it's more of like a little swing rocker um i might still pick it up though i don't know see how i feel but i was playing with this high chair in nordstrom because high chairs are really ugly so i was torn between this one the peg perigo um, I don't know why. For some reason, I really like the Peg Perigo one. I don't know. It's like, it's big, but I just like the way it looks. Um, the Bloom one. But the Bloom one is, like, super modern and stuff. But it doesn't, like, fold up as easy. And then, um, I forget. I think there was, like, one more high chair I was looking at. 
but I decided to go with the Minla on my registry because it's like super super comfortable because it's like fabric um it's not like all plastic I mean it obviously has plastic and stuff but like it has comfortable like jersey material on it um it's like all gray I'll show you the picture when I stand up that's on the box um and it reclines a lot I don't know if you guys remember that as well but it folds up really easy like it folds down so yeah that was a gift off my registry that's actually from Aaliyah she's so sweet um she sent that to us so thank you sis so it looks like this so as, as, as you can see it's my colors it's just light gray heather gray and it has like dark gray plastic and like some light wood tones um so super super easy and I like how this it like connects to the back of it when you're not using it like it just snaps on so yeah super modern so yeah really really like this and again, I'm thinking about, uh, leave. it's like this really young girl driving this minivan, listening to rap music for a while. Like, okay. Um, now that I have this, you guys know I'm weird and I think I'm going to just get the, um, a little bouncer to match just cause I like having matching sets and stuff. It's just so much better. Oh my gosh. So it's Thursday. It's um nine nineteen in the morning. <sighs> Child. <laughs> I've been up since like six thirty because I woke up and I had to pee so bad and I don't know why I had to pee so bad because I actually uh pee two times before I even went to sleep and I didn't drink nothing so I don't know what, like what I was peeing. I talked to Harp this morning. Um, her and her sister they wake up. So, when Harp is home with me Harper wakes up literally at like 11 12 o'clock like I could wake up at 8 o'clock in the morning and Harper is just knocked out. Well her sister she wakes up every day like 8 o'clock in the morning. Um, so yeah, I talked to her, and I just haven't been able to go back to sleep, so I was like, let me just go shower again, because I was like, why my hair smell burnt? Like, it didn't smell clean to me, so I got in the shower to wash my hair, and I shaved. You know, if you're pregnant, the struggle with shaving. Child, I just was using, like, photographic memory, and just my memory in general of where the razor should be at. <laughs> I couldn't see nothing like I could see a little bit but not enough I, I probably should have got a mirror but like wouldn't a mirror fog up in the bathroom but yeah I just was using oh muscle memory that's what it's called I was using muscle memory of where the razor feels like it should go the directions you know just you just have the hand movements down pat I think I'm good for now it's whatever I don't really care right now it's like 12 30 I'm just getting out the bed. I'm waiting for Harp to get home. Um, she should be here. NT second probably. Oh, on. Oh, my back is killing me. I did not sleep good last night whatsoever. Um, I was up to like four tossing and turning. And I kept peeing. I think I peed like four times last night. I didn't even really drink anything. My lips are peeling, so they hurt. So I just have a lip mask on them right now. I don't know. Sometimes, like, no matter how much water I drink, my body still, like, signals that I'm dehydrated. It's really strange. You gotta eat every box. Oh, my God. Remember the whole Sony update? <laughs> and I told you I was not paying them to fix it. I told you I was not... Um, paying them to send it back to me because it just made zero cent and I told them that I said listen listen Linda I'm not finna pay y'all <laughs> it's not easy. um so they stopped responding to my emails guess what just got in the mail free of charge so now I'm gonna try to find a camera repair place to send it to 
so that I can get it fixed. This one is like nothing wrong with it. The scratches that are on the front right there, those are from when it fell in Disney World. They're, they were trying to say that that is what voided my warranty, these scratches. And I was like, it's a vlog camera. Do you really think that people that vlog all day don't drop their cameras? Like, let's be realistic. And you guys know, this thing fell during a roller coaster ride and it still worked and they were like no your scratches are the reason your lens is broke i keep seeing something in the corner of my eye and i don't know if it's in the house um they were like that avoided your warranty first of all hey guys welcome back to my mom's youtube channel Restart this video. We're gonna restart this video because something was going on here. Not going on here. The camera wasn't like it was keep turning red and then like yeah, but let's yeah. So today on this video, um, we're gonna show you how to put two hairs on, or more than two hairs on, on your Roblox. So if you're new here, I'm, I'm, you can turn it up. If you're new here, my name is Harper. Um, I'm a your daughter. Is on, my baby is home. On your vlogs for their kids because people shrug away because on your vlogs it's hard. To How much money you got on Robux though? Um, my baby is 90K home. 90k. This 90k. You mean 9k? Get your toes yeah. out the camera. And I said if they follow me, if why follow you logged out again? I'm not. I'm not. This, this, this is your phone. You logged in on my phone. I know. So like <laughs> I said, like if you follow. If you follow me on TikTok and you follow me on my other account mm -hmm. on YouTube and you follow my mom, I'll do a giveaway. Oh, what are you going to give away? Some stuff for people who is new. Oh, I missed you so much. I don't know what I'm going to do without you. My lip, all oh, the skin is peeling. It hurts. I told you, put some rose puddles on it. I put chapstick on it. It didn't help. You said the baby will be out with it. No, I did not. I said soon. I wanted to go to Target, but I'm lazy. Please, can we go? You don't need nothing from Target. I don't want to. I just want to shop for babies. Let's go tomorrow. No. I guess for the pop ups birthday gift. I had to pay the bills. Order pop up a gift. What are we going to do for Gigi for her birthday? You want to take her to New York? Or yeah. you want to buy her a gift? Uh, uh, I want to take buy her a gift. What do you want to buy her? Mm. Mm, look at you. You're so cute. Nothing happened. That was a long time ago. Say hi. No. <laughs> Say hey, sir. Hi. Long time no see. All I smell is myself. Do you have them perfume? Yeah. I already know. Oh. Is that what I smell? Or is it the time for it? So all I have on time for it too. I have to get sparkly. <laughs> oh, the glitter. Yeah. <laughs> We're on our way to dinner. Um, our reservation was one minute ago. I was so. sure. Why my face looks so fat and pregnant? Um, so yeah, we're on our way to dinner. It's Friday. But yeah. What do you what do you get? A ten minute or fifteen minute grace period? Um we're on our way down. Oh, this is five minutes ahead. It's only eight Here, me put you wanna do it? Put on. I can't see. You look cute, girl. Just throw your Prada bag. It's okay. It's not. It's not Prada. Oh, um, old house. You got it. Oh, can I go pet that dog real quick? No, can I go pet that dog? You better ask. Can I run over there? No, come over walk. I like your outfit. Get, look at Steph's outfit, y'all. Steph, Steph came ready to play. Okay. <laughs> Her and Harp is dressed, and then there's me, sandals, with the bump, Ooh, with the belly. That's what you wearing down there? No, she was doing that before.
Hello. So we just got home from dinner, me and Harpy. We just showered and washed our hair to get all the outside germs and smells off of us. Hold on. <laughs> so yeah, we just got home. It's pretty well we didn't just get home, but it's eleven fifty nine now. Um so we're just gonna climb in bed and watch TV. I think tomorrow where are you going? Huh? Okay. What are you getting? Nothing. No. Um. So, what was I about to say? I think tomorrow my plan is I want to go to Target. Oh, I gotta brush my eyelashes. Um. I want to go to Target because I want to have movie night with her, so we can watch Cru Cruella. Cruella. So I want to go get like popcorn bowls or popcorn holders, some candies. Um and stuff like that so we could watch that together because we like watching all the disney movies but i'm not ready to go to a movie theater yet now i feel like one eye look like i got lazy on the other one don't but yeah all right i'm gonna call it a night say good night harp yeah. harp is sleeping with me tonight because i missed her so much and i'm just gonna love on her all night right oh my goodness good okay. morning from the girls the girls the girls what are you making that sound for Say good morning. We're gonna go grab some Starbucks, some breakfast, and then we have to go to Target because I need laundry detergent, um, some stuff for the drains. Um, I'm gonna see if there's anything I need for the baby. And then, oh, we need snacks for movie night because we're doing movie night tonight. And I think that's pretty much it. And whatever else we find, you know, the vibes. So we're gonna go get dressed. Should we wear matching outfits today? What should we wear? Biker shorts? What kind of shoes should we wear? What? The shoes that have that one in the Crocs? No, the one like this. Nikes? We're gonna wear sneakers, it's hot outside. Yeah, we're gonna go get dressed and stuff and head to Starbucks for the first stop of the day because I'm hungry. Kind of torn. Like, do I want a very berry hibiscus or do I just want a green tea lemonade? Like, do I want to get back to my roots? I don't know. I can honestly just do one each. But yeah, let's go do that while it's early because it's Saturday and I don't feel like seeing people. So let's go. What's the thing you do, Harp? Let's go. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna oof, oof. Because he's so stinking cute. Say twins. Twins. So I have a. There's these grips that my mom bought me. And our Crocs? We got our Crocs, but our are different, but... Mine's is from Disney World. Yeah, mine is from somewhere else. But it don't really have to match that much. You look cute when you wear color. Mm -hmm. When we walk in, you gotta put your mask on when you get in a cart. Why? Wow, are we in the cart? Huh? You can sit in the cart and drink your drink. You gotta wait till we stop the cart and there's nobody around to drink it. Why would I lie to you? It's not my fidget. It says fidget toy set. 
Oh, oh, oh. Oh, they came with more squishies. Alright, here's your fidgets. Thank you. Oh, yeah. So you tricked me. You got a bag of fidgets and you got fidgets with squishies? No. What are you going to do with all these squishies? Oh, look at the little panda. Him is so cute. Aww. Then I got some um, glass straws. Because you guys remember I bought the um, metal ones. I never planned on using the metal ones long term. Because I know like in my mind it's kind of disgusting. Like Because I can't see. I can't see if they're clean or not. Oh, that's cool. Um... So like, I just was testing whether or not I would actually grab for them, and I did. So I'm gonna throw all of those out, and I just picked up some glass ones. But like, they're nice and like wide. I don't know if you guys can see that, which is nice. So I'm gonna wash those, put them in the kitchen. So then we got stuff for movie night, but it's like in all these different bags. So Harper got some marshmallows because she likes marshmallows. Yuck. And then she got some Reese's. Okay. I'm in a second. We're gonna take a shower. Outside. I just got a pack of Reese's. I picked this up for the doll because we took him for a walk the other day. Um, and I just felt like he was thirsty, so it's like a little retractable bowl. Oh. I don't know. It's cute. It's like collapsible. So I'm just hooked this on his leash. Um, that's the first bag from RJ. I secured the skincare. I repeat, I secured the skincare. All right, then I got a. Uh, um, popcorn bowl for our popcorn I'll put our snacks in here so it's ready so it's not just floating i got us some pjs so harper got these for movie night they just have snacks all over it very fitting right super cute so she got those i don't know what to do with stuff it's like there's stuff everywhere and then me I picked up a couple actually. I spent three hundred dollars at Target. I didn't even get nothing. Like I think she scanned everything seven times because it's no way. So I got a new hairbrush because I needed like a harder one. Mine was too soft. I don't. I saw this in the men's department. Kind of air men. Kind of air man. He one hundred percent bore bristle. Yeah, I picked that up. I forgot some bracelets again. These were six Dolores. And then for my movie night PJs to match hers, I got these purple shorts. They're from the same collection as the gray pants that I told you guys I love. Um, so I got these ones in a small. And then I picked up a purple maternity tank. I don't know. I just thought purple would be cute. So we're going to wear those when we get out the shower. Um... And then I also picked up the short version of those pants I have because I like them because they're soft. These are $15. Target is so expensive. And I got these. They're like tie-dye and like mauve. Because I told you guys I was going to get the gray ones again. And then every other color, it was like so dark. So I just got those. So I had this already. I got this in Bye Bye Baby. This is a... um is a um diaper caddy so i got this to put in the living room so i just picked up some diapers to put down here i have like extra ones but i just wanted to buy like some just for this and i know some people like the honest company diapers and some people don't so i figured i just try them it's not that serious so i picked up two of these even though i have i think i have like seven of these <laughs> And then we got Harp, this bathing suit. I don't know, it was super cute. We walked by it. And I just thought it was like sassy, you know? So yeah, I got her thoughts. Um, I guess this should go in the bed with the clothes. <sighs> Can't reach nothing. So that's all I got from Target, I think. Oh, and then I picked up um, the Freedom Mom Labor and Delivery Postpartum Recovery Kit. This is the one that has the... I don't know. Oh, this one has everything in it. This one has... Harper, who, what are you doing? 
It says, after the partum is the after party. Kick that hospital bag packing list to the curb. This one step prep takes you from first contraction to first postpartum bathroom trip. Uh, Alright, so I'm literally about to get in the shower, but I wanted to open this postpartum box. One, to get rid of the box. Two, um, to show you guys, I'm like straightening up, putting everything away except for Harper's laundry. That will get done <coughs> who knows when, you know? So, I guess every yeah everything comes in this one. So, this is the one you're supposed to throw in your hospital bag. Um, my hospital provides all this stuff. So, I don't really feel pressured to take it. I'll probably just leave this one in the house because you can never have too much of this. Bless you. You can never have too much of this stuff. So, again, it just has the spray peri bottle in here, the wipes, the foam. I heard that some people like this foam a lot better than the wipes. I never had issues with the wipes. I used the witch hazel ones i forget what brand but like the brand most hospitals tell you to um it has four boy shorts in here and then um two pads i cannot believe these things are so big like the things we do to have kids um and it comes with like the same old paper doctor caddy that the other one has that i have the one that's like meant for the bathroom and this one just has everything so i honestly probably just put all this stuff under my sink too because the thing about it is like i said the hospital gives you these and i know they people have said they're better um but i feel like i feel like it's not until you're really home that everything kind of starts to sink in like i don't remember what are you doing i don't remember really feeling like oh this hurts until i was home recovering like the first couple days after the hospital i feel like in the hospital it kind of always like a blur um but once the epidural was like wearing off and stuff um i'll probably take one of the peri bottles because i heard that this peri bottle is better than the ones the hospital gives you because the one that the hospital gives you you just spray up Whereas this one, you could spray, hold it down, and they say it's just a better angle. So I'll put this one in the hospital bed because I already bought one. So I have one for home. Um, and then I'll obviously just bring this one home too. And then all this other stuff, I feel like, again, I'll be fine for two days. The panties, I mean, they're just jumbo, ginormous panties. Of course, they're not the best things to wear. But I'd rather have a few of the good ones at home so I can be like super comfortable. But they did have the labor and delivery socks. So these are the ones with the sticky things on the bottom or the gel pads so you don't fall. And then it had a maternity gown or a labor and delivery gown, which was nice. I was going to buy this separately, but I heard it was like massive because it's one size fits all, which I get. Um, but I just was like, it's not that serious. But it does seem super super comfortable and soft um i was like looking at all the corny ones with prints and stuff i don't really like them so i'm gonna throw this in the washing machine so it could be nice and clean before i put it in my bag but i am gonna pick this one um just because it'll be nice to just be able to wear something from home that's like comfortable it has buttons so they can access everything and you could wear this during labor or afterwards if you want to it's kind of depends on you so it has buttons at the boob buttons at the back and it has pockets which is nice so yeah i'm gonna wash this put this in my laundry basket so it can be washed put these and this in my return my labor and delivery bag or my hospital bag and that's it really the rest of the stuff I'm gonna put home. so i'm gonna put this under my sink so yeah i'm gonna go take a shower now wash my hair for the one millionth time you guys know how i well i'm not gonna wash it i'm just gonna wet it because there's actually no product in it or gel or anything so i'm just gonna wet it um because i just don't feel clean especially like after just being outside like i just cannot oh my hair will feel disgusting you got some games on your phone <laughs> So we just showered, we just brushed our hair, and we got on our coordinated jammies for movie night, right? We're matching jammies. So we're gonna take a picture real quick. Okay, I'm gonna press the button. Hold on, ready? Mm -hmm. Got it. 
Okay, just, so mommy's just, wearing all purple. Mommy has on light purple and a purple tank. So, Let me see yours. And mine is pink, mm -hmm. so we're in a squad. Oh yeah, we are, huh? Say ready for movie night. Yeah, we're, we're not gonna record it. We got our ponytails. Okay, I'm gonna go edit this video and then we're yeah. gonna get ready once the sun goes down. Yep. Ooh. Ooh, movie night loading.